Hey, it's Eric from eDrum Center, and we're here to do an uh, unboxing and photo shoot of the KD220 from Roland. Here you can see we're unboxing it. It's, uh, it's a big box. It comes comes shipped pretty well. It's, it's got plenty of padding in there, which we like. We don't want anything to get broken on transit to our customers, obviously. Packed pretty well. We, un we unpacked it, and uh, it's amazing looking drum. Way better than the pictures that Roland put out in January when they introduced it. It's, it's significantly um, better in, in uh, these pictures, so we're glad we unboxed it. It's, uh, of course, got the KDA or KDA22 kick trigger installed onto it already, which is universally pretty well regarded. It, people like the way it feels. I, I agree, I like the way it feels. In fact, this kick drum is probably gonna stay on this kit for a while. We, um, we think we like it better than the KD140, and uh, it just it has a maybe a more solid feel. I'm not sure if it's the uh, the size has really nothing to do with that. I don't think. I think it's the actual pad or or the how they built the pad and the rebound in, inside of it. It just feels much better. Uh, I was able to do um, just stuff easier with with my kick on it than I was on KD140. The, um, the drum just looks amazing. You should get yours on order. If you have a, a, a TD50 KV, you should uh, probably upgrade to this from the KD140. KD140 is a great drum, but this, this is bigger, feels better. It looks amazing. It, it really makes the kit stand out. Um, I can't stress that enough.